I'm going to show y'all how to uh, make a boundary uh, with simulated headlands. Uh, if you decide you want to, you know, plant your ends last, but you want the uh, planter to clutch just like it was already planted. Um, I've actually already made the boundary on uh, this particular one, but I'm going to show you the setup and whatnot, whatnot, what all is involved. If you go to uh, boundary recorder on this one, I have it added to the home screen. Um, we'll go into it, and this is what that screen looks like. It's going to ask us to uh, create a new file or modify an existing file. Um, we would do create new file. Um, and then it says status ready. Um, I always like to, just for my sake, right now the planter is upside down, is touch this north direction uh, icon and then it kind of gives me an idea of what side I'm painting. Um, this is a 38 foot planter so I'm wanting to offset from the center of the tractor 19 foot. In this particular uh, instance I will be going around the field counterclockwise this way and my right side will be the edge of the field so that's why I have it set 19 foot to the right um, so we'll approve that and we'll get lined up on the corner of the field here and we hit record field boundary and as we're driving around the field it's going to be putting us a line right here on the right side of the toolbar um, if you need to make some tight turns or work around something, you can hit pause. Um, otherwise, once you close in that boundary, you'll hit end field boundary. And uh, then we've got a, a boundary loaded. All right, and then we need to go into simulated headlands and this 38 foot planter, so it'll be 38 foot. Um, we'll do create field boundary headland and uh, it will allow us to offset 38 foot in.